Well, police are now telling us that today's shooting was retaliatory for a shooting that occurred not too far away on Fulton Street Wednesday. A man in a red car pulled up right in the middle of Lewis Street here in front of this greenhouse and started shooting at people standing outside the greenhouse. The folks standing outside fired back, according to police, and it was all caught on a neighbor's surveillance. Take a look. Let's get right to it because this is really dramatic. Within seconds of a school bus passing by, a red car drives up and someone in that red car jumps out and opens fire on folks standing in the driveway of the home. Police say the man who jumped out of the red car is Vincent Smith and he was shot in the buttocks as folks in the driveway fired back. During the course of all the shooting, uh, shots were fired into a home across the street into a home where people had nothing to do with whatever the dispute was about. The 80-year-old man who shared the surveillance with us says he and his wife feel unsafe because they say there's always trouble on the street. Listen. I would certainly like to see this neighborhood cleaned up. I'm sick and tired of all this door slam and loud music and, of course, the gunshots. Now, police say today's shooting stemmed from the incident Wednesday in which someone in a car shot at two men, hitting one of them in the arm. And police say Wednesday's victim on Fulton Street, a man identified as Vincent Smith, is the same man who jumped out of the red car today and opened fire. And in the end, Smith was shot again. So he's been shot twice in two days. Smith is hospitalized because of today's bullet wound. Again, shot in, in the buttocks during the course of all of this. Police are still unraveling all of it, putting new details together. We should have an update later today. We're live in Daytona Beach, Volusia County, Claire Matz, West 2 News.